Hello everybody to Ratchet and Clank going commando. Oh my gosh, I've been wanting to play this game for a while now. At least over a month I'd say. So it's it's nice to be finally uh, getting to it. Getting things going, rolling and going. You know, come to think of it, we became a commando to, uh, you know, learn all these flips and tricks and do all this survival stuff. All we're doing is just saving this little fuzzy fluffy thing. A, a blue fuzzy fluffy thing, you know? We're, we're basically saving a smurf pet. Or a neil pet. It kind of looks like a neil pet. But hey, we gotta do what we gotta do. You know, gotta start somewhere, I suppose. Can't just start off, you know, on the first day of the job as a police officer just saving the president's daughter or anything. You know, that's totally never happened before, ever. At a game I've never played. Yet I still know the plot, too, because I'm... Because of stuff. Anyways, I, I guess I could explain a little bit of stuff. Uh, the red bar at the top there, once that gets to full, we do this massively powerful light attack thing that flashes light and things die. That's always fun. Uh, the red little uh, bar on the top left. Once that gets to full, we get a uh, level 2 weapon, which does a lot more damage, more ammo, more uh, range, eh, different things like that. Some of the weapons even change too, which is pretty interesting. I see it's time to update my security forces. Whoa, whoa, no, hey, no, no, look, I'm just here to fix the transflexor coil. Nice try. Give my regards to Megacorp. Finish him. <laughs> Uh, one thing I love about this game is just its humor and its comedic elements, I guess you could say. I don't know, it, it just, it's so lighthearted, it doesn't really take itself too seriously, and I really like that about this game. It's one of those games where it's just like, you can just like watch the cutscenes and, you know, no matter how many times you watch them, it, it's still interesting, it's still fun to watch. So, um, I actually do plan on not really talking over any of the cutscenes. Just because I do want to show off how awesome they are and things like that. Plus, I don't exactly have much better to say than what's showing in the cutscene anyway. But I'll get more on that in just a sec. Bugs for less. If it ain't broke, we'll break it. Right. I'm in the market for some security. You'll bring the cash, we'll bring the thrash. Good. I need your best men to meet me at these coordinates. Okie dokie. Uh, like I was saying, I don't exactly have the best stuff to really talk about during the cutscene. Also because I just want to show off what the cutscene is and everything, and it's... You know. I mean, you get to hear me enough anyways during the, uh, more action-oriented and things like that. So I don't, I don't really think I need to really be speaking during the cutscenes. You know, unless I have something completely thought-provoking that could just people, make people's minds explode. Which, oh jeez, nope, 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 okay, there we go. Ooh, Strafen is your friend in this game. Absolutely your friend. You're seriously going to see me, uh, strafing quite a bit in this game. If not all the time, honestly. Let's see here, uh, one gravity bomb, sweet. I actually do want to level up the gravity bomb as quickly as I can. We'll be getting more into that in a little bit, and you'll see why I want to get it all powered up and all that good stuff, but that will be happening at some point in the future. Hello. As I speak in the cutscene. <laughs> oh, I'm a hypocrite. Ratchet checking in, sir. Incredulous. I didn't expect to hear from you again. Uh, so soon. There was a slight problem. The thief escaped with the experiment, 
and I have no idea where he was headed. Not to worry. I just received an omission which may lubricate the matter. Do you have any maps for this quadrant of the galaxy? You bet, mister! We got galactic maps, 3D maps, foldouts, cutouts, maps to the stars, and their homes! Sorry about that. Oh, I forgot my wallet. Could you, you know, take care of this? Perimeter defenses deactivated. <laughs> You forgot your change. I'm on my way. Okay, dokie, and we have just completed my favorite part of the game. <laughs> Honestly, I absolutely love the beginning part. What's funny though is like a lot of games I don't really like the beginning for some reason. It's just kind of boring to me. I don't know if it's just like you don't really have that much to it or there's not much going on or whatever. I'm not really sure, but it just doesn't really interest me much, but in this game, it's completely different. I mean, I love pretty much every aspect of this game, but you really can't go wrong with the beginning there. For me. Now, the gun that I got there was the chopper. Um, I actually want to have that uh, gun get upgraded as soon as possible as well. Generally, actually, at the same time as the uh, as this, uh, gravity... Whatever it's called, I don't remember. I just remember the it's upgraded name. This is like the gravity cannon or something? I don't remember. I don't really care enough to really look it up, but I probably will anyway. Yep, see? Gravity bomb. Ah, eh, close enough. I don't know, the upgraded version's name is a lot better anyway, I think. Spoilers, it's the mini nuke, because it nukes stuff, which is fun. I like nuking stuff. Even though it does uh, make the flavor a little bit more bland, but, you know, what are you going to do? Oh, gosh, dang it. Alright, see, we actually are doing really well with this gun. It's already almost upgraded. Well, that's about, what, halfway? A little more than halfway? Wow, I'm actually kind of surprised. Pleasantly surprised, of course. Let's need to chop to get rid of these guys. There we go. Ah, there you go. Yeah, um, seizures inbound sometimes. Uh, later on it won't be happening so much, but right now we actually gain a lot of experience, surprisingly. A lot of experience starting off. But hey, gotta take the experience while you can. It's uh, definitely a good thing. Now, let's see if I can make this. I should be able to. I... There we go. Wow, that... generally that takes like two jumps. <laughs> Speedrun strat. Only should take one cycle. Yeah, totally. I could totally speedrun this game, yeah. Well, maybe I could. Maybe. That's a big maybe. It kind of depends on what you prefer as speedrunning in this game. Me, I... I don't know. I could speedrun a few games if I put in the effort, but... Honestly, I, I probably won't put in the effort because... I don't know. I'm more of a casual gamer. Personally, I absolutely oh crap. Okay, I absolutely love watching speedruns. Like I love watching them, but in terms of uh, actually doing my own, it doesn't interest me enough. I don't really have the uh, mindset to put in thousands of hours into a game, even if it is like Secret of Mana, which is one of my favorite games, if not the favorite. I don't know. I don't really like saying what my favorites are in things, like my favorite book or favorite movie or video, favorite video game. Because, I don't know, there's just too many to choose from, and I have so much... Like, I don't know. I can't really just pinpoint to one thing that is specifically the absolute top dog out of all the other ones. It just... I don't know, I just can't do that. I love so many different things for so many different reasons that it's, it, I don't know, for me it's hard to pinpoint. But I mean, if you can say specifically what your favorite is, you know, that's absolutely awesome. And actually, I'd like to hear that if you, if you want. If you want to show, like, say what favorite book or is or whatever, you know, whatever you feel like sharing. It's absolutely awesome. It's kind of funny too, because, uh, Generally, this part takes me about 12 to 15 minutes, but it's actually... Over the years, I've gotten a little bit faster this game, I guess. I've been playing this game since I was like... Frick, what? 12, I think? 
maybe earlier than that. I don't know when this game came out, or when I got it, honestly. But, you know, it is what it is. Yeah, I've, pl I've played this game freaking dozens of times at this point. Wee! Splat. Welcome, welcome. Uh, if everyone could take their seats, we can proceed with today's demonstration. First, I'll need a volunteer. Anyone? Excellent. Your name, sir. Ratchet. Hey! And there you have it. The Megacorp tractor beam in action. Let's give it up for our volunteer. Sir, how about taking advantage of our show special? Thank you, sir. You won't be disappointed. Okay, um, I just got this huge feeling in the pit of my stomach, like that butterfly feeling, or like, like that feeling where like, your crush like, talks to you is like, hey, let's hang out, like that kind of feeling you get. I just got that right now, and I have no idea why. Hmm. Huh. I don't know, maybe somebody's dreaming about me, or thinking about me or something, I don't know. <laughs> maybe. If someone's thinking about me, that would make my day, because... People who care about me are, are awesome, and well, I, I guess everyone's awesome because because they can be, and they are. Unless you do shitty things, then you're a shitty person. But then again, who am I to judge? I'm a shitty person too. To be fair, I guess we're all kind of shitty people. But you know, well, I guess I'll rephrase that. We're good people who do shitty things sometimes. But that's the way the world works. Anyways, I don't know why I got into that. That's completely random, but whatever. Damn, we are almost done with that already. Hmm, absolutely awesome. Um, I think that's pretty much it I want to do for today. Yeah, we'll end the episode off here. Um, I'm not really sure how long the episodes are going to be. Generally, probably between, again, 10 to 15 minutes, like usual. Um, perhaps later on I'll end up doing, like, longer parts, but I don't know. If you, if you guys want me to do longer parts, you know, let me know. I'll definitely get to that as soon as I can, although I do stock up on videos uh, quite a bit early on, but so it won't happen until like a little bit later, but it, I, I definitely listen to your feedback, and if you have any feedback of anything at all, you know, comments, questions, criticisms, praises, anything you want, let me know if you feel like it, it's up to you. And uh, with that, uh, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed. And in the next video, we'll be tackling on the rest of this world and starting off on the next one. So, I hope you have a wonderful day.